Bye bye, hon. All right, let's check this place out. We got a picture of uh, Hiriam Thornton, 1867 to 1937. Okie dokie do. Um, got a fireplace. And I, I think there's a phone charm in here, is there not? Um, no, maybe there's not. Okay. Um, there's a book here. Espionage in a bonnet. Female secret agents of the Civil War. And was that from Danger by Design? I think. Maybe I'm wrong. Yep. Uh huh. Yep. 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 That's nice. Sounds good. There are two people there. Wonderful book. Man, can I read that again? Ooh, what's this? Nuts. <laughs> When the winds grew cold and the waves made passage back to the mainland difficult, the workers were granted permission to stay overnight in the factory. None survived. That was a fantastic story. The long, cold night on Black Rock. What a name for a story. Thornton Hall. That is quite glowy. Wow. Wow. Um, wow. This is Jeb Thornton and... Sarah Emma Wakeman, I think? I think that's what it says. Let me look at anything else here. Nope. Um, I already talked to you. Let's go over here. Let's, uh, ooh, let's take these oranges. Let's make some tea. Okay, let's uh, put some tea in, uh, tea in here. i like some sugar, please. i like a lemon, lime, lemon, what am I talking about? Lime and some mint. Ooh, nice. Let's take a napkin. I already have one. Oh no, I want another one. I already one. have one. Give me another one. Come on, Nancy. No. Mm. Okay, you know I think there's one more thing we can look at here, but maybe not. No, I think you're supposed to look at this board right here. But we'll do that later. Whatever. Okay, let's take a look at this picture here. This is Beauregard Thornton. I don't know who he is. Thornton, that's him. Alrighty, so, uh, okay, so here we need to charge the dead phone with a broken charger. Whoa. There's an electricity manual here. For making batteries with common household items, do it yourself. Oh, I've always wanted to do this, guys. You don't even know. Okay, ooh, okay. It's a battery. Nice. Citrus. Oh, man. We got some citrus right here, boys. Yes. Oh, these person, these people won a uh, contest from Her Interactive and got their name posted or their picture posted in the game. Kind of cool. Kind of want that to happen to me. All right. So these nails here. Take them nails. And I think there's one more thing. I don't have all the parts I need. Oh, you have the pennies. So, so stupid. Um. Is there anything to Oh, this looks this? like a painting. Ooh. I should find somewhere to place it. Okay, I'll take that painting. What what else is there to do? Um What? Oh, what is that? What is that? Oh, the picker. Nose picker? No? Yes, no. Oh no. Nose picker. You see what I did there? How? Oh. Thornton family cotton processing this door was from the barn that housed the equipment for processing the cotton. Many a worker lost their fingers in the processing room. So let's get in there. That didn't sound good. Oh, guys. Let's, let, let's not do that again now, shall we? Take this spade. Um, so, ooh, there's the pennies. There's the pennies, and there's a... Uh, oh. Hmm. Let's put that up, right? Okay. Hmm. Film real. Hmm. Mm -hmm, hmm, hmm, hmm. Let's uh, spade this open. Hmm. Let's dead phone it open. Hmm. Nope. Okay, and there is one more thing. This is the cotton gin. I don't know why it's called cotton gin. Maybe, maybe the guy who made it was he worked in the cotton industry and uh, he drank Time to gin. Recharge the battery. Can you even drink gin? I think you can drink it. Hmm. Maybe I'm just. Maybe I've been drinking too much gin. Can't do that yet. Why not? Oh, the nails, of course. Nails, pennies. All right. There Let's we go. See if all those oranges did the trick. Awesome. Okay, so we just gotta wait and uh, wait for that to. Uh, no, I'm saying. Let's take this turpentine. 
pure gum spirits. Hey, I'm chewing some gum right now. That's not the same kind of gum that they're talking about, though. All right, that's, uh, that's phone Addison. Nope, sorry, guys. You know me when it comes to cell phones. I always got to uh, customize a bike, lab, uh, cats. Nope, scoop, mm, Finster, River Heights. No, you know what? I like Finster. Finster's pretty cool. Ring. Standard. Nope. Owl? Nope. Nope. Oh, guys. I think I just found mine. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Nope. 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 Definitely recording. That's pretty cool. Got some games on my phone because this is also the bonus edition. So that's, uh, that's a little cool there. You don't have to play any of those, these are just completely optional and fun. My favorite one out of all these is probably Land Rush, uh, then Wires, then one of these two, then Double Take, then this. I do not like this one at all. I'm not good at Renograms. Alright, let's phone Addison Hammond. Oh, guys, that accordion though. Hello? Addison? My name is Nancy Drew. I'm calling to see if you can help me with something. Is this about Jessalyn? It yes. is indeed, mate. I can't. I'm sorry. Why not? The sooner we can find out what happened to her, the better her chances of survival. Okay. I'll help with what I can. I can't. I'm sorry. It'll help her live. Okay, I'll talk. How's Jessalyn's relationship with Clara? Okay. Maybe a little strained. How so? Jess used to call her Chairman Mom. Behind her back, of course. Well, if I did that to my mom, she'd be... She'd either laugh... Or... No, she'd, she'd probably just laugh. Do you think Clara could have anything to do with Jessalyn going missing? I don't think Jess was afraid of Clara. But still, I can't say for sure. Mmm, he just said for sure, so... What do you think of Colton? He kind of can. What's to think? He's always been decent to me and Jess. The bedroom key is crossed out in the scavenger hunt. Do you know where it is? No. Jessalyn must have found it. But I couldn't tell you where it is. Dude, you're so quiet. You just say you answer very quickly and... No, not really quickly. Shortly. You answer very shortly. I want to... I want to know more. I need to know more. Can you walk me through what happened the night Jessalyn went missing? She was about to get married, and I think the pressure of it was getting to her. It was supposed to be a night of blowing off some steam. Jess always loved a good scare. She used to make me sneak into scary movies with her when we were kids. So I've never in a weird snuck way, into a movie. Have you guys ever snuck into a movie? Sort of if you have, what movie did you sneak party. into? Because I've never done At that before. At first, it was really fun. We were running around trying to scare ourselves silly. We were making these recordings like we were on a ghost hunter show. Then things got strange. Oh, that's what they all say. But how did it get strange? How? 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 Um, how? Is there anything you remember that might help me find Jessalyn? No. Why not? Actually, wait. Hang on. Yes, there is. Upstairs, uh, there was this door. Was the, door. To get it open. the door, the door that all, me, the door knows all that once was and all that once will really? be. What? Why? All that once was and all that will be. Eyes on me all night long. Okay, so you say I could feel eyes on me all night long. Either she felt someone looking at her all night long, or she physically felt eyeballs resting on her. Oh, that's disgusting. Ugh. Oh, gives me the heebie-jeebies. What were you doing at Thornton Hall that night? A scavenger hunt, but I don't know. There was something strange about it. In what way? Jess was looking for something toward the end of the night. Kind of desperately. It stopped being fun. That's all I know. Is it all you know, though? I think you know more. You just don't want to tell me more because you don't trust me because you never talked to me before because I'm nice and true. Boom! How was Jessalyn acting that night? She was classic Jess for most of the night. Then something happened? Yeah. We were in the house and suddenly oh, she just screamed. Oh, we went screamed. into the house and then and she then just screamed. And then she's nowhere to be found. What happened? I was alone in the house, jumping at every noise, too afraid to move. It felt like hours. The 
and she came back. She wouldn't say what had happened. She wouldn't even talk to me. She wanted to be left alone. She went downstairs, and that was that. <laughs> 